Do you remember your first movie featuring a robot or AI? How did it make you feel about the future, technology, AI? As a young girl growing up in Ukraine, I was fascinated by the world of movies. We didn't have much, but we had a neighborhood theater, and I spent a ton of time looking at a massive screen. It was there that for the first time, I encountered Hollywood's depiction of AI and machines. One movie in particular left a massive impression on my young mind. Can anyone guess what it was? It was a Terminator. <laughs> yes, remember Terminator? An unfeeling, relentless machine pursuing its human targets in apocalyptic chase where humans are at war with their own creations? That one. <laughs> Quotes like this will forever stay in my mind. Human beings are a disease, a cancer of the planet. Or this. The matrix is everywhere. It is all around us. Or this. It can't be bargained with. It can't be reasoned with. It doesn't feel pity or remorse or fear. I watched these movies again and again, and every time I wondered, is this what Americans imagine for us? Here is the wealthiest country in the world. And this is the future we're envisioning. Hollywood has ingrained a narrative in our mind that AI and technology is a malevolent force and our future hangs in balance. But let me ask you this. Does that correspond to your reality? Is that your relationship with your technology and AI today? Have you ever had a positive experience with AI? That fraud detection call from your bank? That very helpful suggestion in e-commerce such as Amazon that led you to the exact purchase that you want to have? That meaningful conversation and interaction with Alexa or Siri, or a self-driving car. The truth is that Hollywood's depiction of AI does not match the reality. That conflict of human versus AI looks amazing on a big screen, but it doesn't correspond to our reality. Have you considered how much AI is already part of our lives. In healthcare, we use AI for timely and precise diagnosis. Take cancer, where early and precise diagnosis makes a difference between life and death. AI is your partner in saving lives. In business, where data-driven decisions our norm, we rely on AI to get to operational excellence and profitability much, much sooner. And in the process, we create opportunities. And yes, jobs, the impact of AI is well, well beyond the boardroom. Every day, mothers, students, normal people like you and I rely on technology and AI for fraud detection, suggestions, streamline their lives so they can focus on stuff that matters, stuff that gives them joy. AI is becoming a silent assistant that helps us get through life and thrive, often without requiring a thank you. The future of AI is not in competition. The future of AI is in partnership and collaboration. We, as human partners, 
must show up in a way that adds value. We must become amazing teammates. And if you're wondering how, that is the right question to ask. Let me introduce you to TRACE framework. TRACE stands for Acronyms of Technological Proficiency, Responsibility and Ethics, Adaptability, Creative Thinking, and Emotional Intelligence. And what a better way to illustrate TRACE than by using another iconic movie, Her. Her is a touching story about theater, a lonely writer who has a relationship with Samantha, the AI operating system. During the movie, various themes are explored, including technology, emotions, and yes, AI. Let's start with technological proficiency. AI is already here. It is here to stay. We absolutely must accept it. And we must understand how it works. What are its virtues and limitations in every field? Theater in the movie Her exemplifies that proficiency. He learns how this technology works. In fact, he becomes more than a user. He tinkers with that technology. He adjusts the setting. He makes sure that Samantha makes sense and works in his personal and professional life. Responsibility and ethics is your second pillar. Every technology we've had had impact on us as individuals, the world around us, and yes, our future. Theodore approaches Samantha in a very thoughtful way. He asks questions like, should she have independent thoughts and feelings? Does that make sense? He realizes the impact this technology has on him and then wonders how the social fabric of the world around him will change as well. Adaptability is your third pillar. We must be able to change our thoughts and our action and our, our future as the world around us changes at an increasing rate. Throughout the movie, we see theater first being introduced to this technology, then figuring out how it works, then adjusting it to his life, and then master it. He exemplifies that quality of adaptability. The fourth pillar is creativity. Yes, it is that out-of-the-box thinking that we're all thinking about, but it's much more than that. It is also our ability to combine disparate things from other disciplines and combine them in a novel way. In the movie Her, Theodore and Samantha create together. They build on each other's ideas and in the process co-create something bigger than they each would be able to come up individually. At some point, Theodore asks Samantha for recommendations when he explores the city he already knows and then he realizes that he's looking at a familiar through a completely different lens. That's creativity in action. The final item on a trace framework is emotional intelligence. It is that ability to check in with yourself and understand where you are emotionally and the world around you. Yes, humans, yes, other beings, yes, technology as well. In the movie Her, theater approaches Samantha very intentionally. At some point, 
she expresses her disappointment that she doesn't have a physical body. He listens to her carefully, acknowledges her feelings as valid, and through a conversation, both of them grow together. That's an emotionally mature individual. Trace framework is not just a theoretical concept. Those are the skills we need to become good teammates. These are the skills we need to show up to this partnership and lead it. How are you envisioning AI in the next decade or so? What are your hopes and dreams, fears for this technology? And how will you show up as a good teammate? Embrace Trace Framework. Gain some skills. We can build a future where technology allows us to be more human, where our innovation is led by our morals and our ability to change makes us strong. The future of AI is not man versus machines. The future of AI is man with machines. Close your eyes. Yes, close your eyes. Imagine a world where humans and AI work side by side. They show up for each other every single day. They have each other's back. Their relationship is productive, harmonious, and joyful. How does that image make you feel? Keep your eyes closed, no cheating. How is that different from a classic depiction by Hollywood? That happy feeling of AI and humans working side by side is possible. It's possible for you, for me, for all of us. All we have to do is gain some skills, show up every day, and co-create an amazing future together. Thank you so much.